Hey everyone, Ken Ross here and I'm a business consultant that specializes in cost reduction for businesses by looking at their essential expenses. And today what I have for you is a quick channel update. What I'm going to be working on next, my next series, because I did my first series on how to save you money right now today on your business expenses is financial health. I really do believe businesses need to focus on financial health and if they aren't focusing on financial health, then how are you going to be able to pivot your business or, or adjust your business as needed, especially given the times that we're in? There's a lot of businesses out there that are struggling with understanding how the pandemic has affected their business, being able to pivot so that they can adjust their business just, just right so that they can continue to operate. I know there are a lot of business owners today, and I've even talked to some of them, that are taking losses because they don't have enough customers or taking losses because the expenses that they have are just too much. The extra expense or the expense that changes, it fluctuates, such as something like fuel charges on shipping things or uh, maybe even just the price of certain products because as products fluctuate in price, so does their bill when it comes to acquiring those products. And so this is why financial health is so important to a business because you can't just find money somewhere or you can't just acquire a, a loan without some type of ramifications. And of course, during, during COVID, there were many opportunities that the government gave to save your business by rolling out an SBA loan. But even that was something that had a lot of requirements. So being in a position in a healthy position financially allows you, excuse me, allows you the luxury of being able to know exactly how to take advantage of certain programs that come around, being able to fund or pivot your business in such a way so that you can be in a place to shift providers or shift service services or products that you're getting. Those types of things do matter, and if you're not in a position to do that, then you're gonna, it's going to be costly. It's going to cost you a lot of money. So what I plan to do is this. I actually plan to partner with a lot of people in, in business, in financial services, and have them explain why it's so important to have a good financial plan and why what they offer is something that actually will benefit your business and how it ties to your business, because like I said, these types of things, you can't just depend on one person or yourself to do. You have to have experts. So I plan to show you some of those experts and what it is that they do and explain to you why this is so important for your business, why this is a healthy thing financially for your business. Because if, you, if you're not paying attention to those things, you're going to be in a situation, just like a lot of other businesses today, that have to decide whether or not they should stay, stay open or operate because they don't have all the information. So with that, that's what I have today. I'd love to hear your comments down below on this new series, um, what, it's gonna, what you think it should offer, if there are people in financial services that you would really love to hear from. I plan to connect with maybe some banks, bankers, I'm sorry, people that are uh, into debt reduc reduction, what that's, what that's all about, uh, CPAs, people in business that really do look at a lot of numbers. And that's going to be kind of the people that I'm going to present to you. And I would love to know, are there people in financial services that you'd love to hear from that you don't necessarily hear from all the time and what their perspective is? Please put that in the comments section below. And please, if you haven't already, subscribe to this channel, like this video because there'll be more to come. And if you like this video, then you'll definitely like the next video where I'm interviewing relevant people in financial services that should help you understand how to remain healthy as a business owner. And so until next time, I am Ken Ross. Please visit my website. I am KenRoss.com and I'll see you around.